Another day, another book review. A promised land, a journey with Barack Obama, book review. Hey, everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a remarkable book, A Promised Land, by none other than the 44th President of the United States, Barack Obama. So, grab a cup of coffee, and let's explore this fascinating memoir together. Before we begin, if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell to stay updated on all our latest content. Now, let's jump right in. Book Summary Published in 2020, A Promised Land is the first volume of Obama's highly anticipated presidential memoirs. The book covers his early political career, his historic 2008 election, and his first term in the White House. It's a candid, introspective, and highly personal account of the challenges, triumphs, and disappointments he faced during his time in office. Throughout the book, Obama candidly shares his thoughts and reflections on major events and decisions. From the Affordable Care Act to the military operation that led to the death of Osama bin Laden, we get an inside look at the complexities and nuances of these moments in history. Now, let's explore some of the key themes and takeaways from A Promised Land. Key Themes and Takeaways the power of hope. One of the most compelling aspects of the book is Obama's unwavering belief in hope. His message of hope and change resonated with millions of Americans during his campaign, and it's a theme that carries through the entire book. Despite the many challenges he faced, Obama never lost sight of the potential for progress and the importance of remaining optimistic leadership and decision-making. Obama's memoir provides a masterclass in leadership and decision-making. He reveals the complexity of balancing competing interests, managing a diverse team, and making difficult decisions with far-reaching consequences. Obama's insights on leadership are invaluable, whether you're a student of politics or just looking to improve your own decision-making skills. The Role of Race As the first African-American president, race was an ever-present factor during Obama's tenure. He shares his experiences with racism, both subtle and overt, and reflects on how his unique background influenced his decisions and worldview. This candid exploration of race in America is an essential component of understanding Obama's presidency. The importance of family. Throughout the book, Obama emphasizes the importance of family. Despite the demands of the presidency, he consistently prioritizes his relationship with his wife, Michelle, and the daughters, Malia and Sasha. This emphasis on family serves as a reminder of the personal sacrifices that come with public service. Personal Reflections Reading A Promised Land was an incredible experience. It was truly inspiring to hear Obama's perspective on the challenges and triumphs he faced during his time in office. His unwavering belief in the power of hope and the potential for progress was a refreshing reminder of the importance of optimism in an increasingly cynical world. As a reader, I appreciated Obama's candid and honest exploration of the complexities of leadership and decision-making. It was fascinating to gain insight into the thought processes behind some of the most significant moments in recent history. Moreover, his reflections on race and the importance of family added depth and nuance to the narrative, making it a truly engaging read. Recommendation. So, 
Would I recommend a promised land to others? Absolutely. Whether you're a fan of Barack Obama, interested in American politics, or simply love a well-written memoir, this book is a must-read. It's a captivating exploration of leadership, hope, and the personal side of politics that will leave you inspired and eager for the next volume of his memoirs. That's it for today's book review of A Promised Land by Barack Obama. I hope you enjoyed this exploration of his memoir, and I encourage you to pick up a copy and read it for yourself. If you've already read the book, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. As always, thank you for joining me on this literary journey. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more book reviews and discussions. Until next time, happy reading.